Shalom, my name is Yeshua Yaakov, and this video is being made from Jerusalem that comments upon uh, uh, the, uh, the patriotism of both Barak and Michelle. First, uh, the context is the rebranding of uh, patriotism in general, uh, the issue of uh, him wearing uh, a flag and saluting. Uh, let us be very clear in terms of what is in fact uh, happening here. Um, Barack Obama understands, as does his absolutely brilliant wife, Michelle Obama, the fundamental difference between object reference and subject reference patriotism. While we have uh, wonderful uh, icons of national leadership standing up with pens in their lapel and flags like, uh, like Mr. Cheney, who's uh, slicking the American taxpayers and his former uh, corporation, Halliburton, uh, has record profits of 15.3 billion, and guess what? Uh, 3.5 billion of profits. Net profit in 2007 was 22.87 percent, which is almost 50 percent gross profit. Now here's a guy who really stands up and pledges allegiance to the flag and wears a a, 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 a little flag in his lapel and salutes and has his hand on his heart. Uh, this is the object reference con artist, uh, and this is in patriotism. Uh, and uh, I'm not saying that, uh, that he's not a patriot, but he's got the double standard of patriotism. The higher, the, the more valuable, the more ethical, the more moral. Uh, patriotism is the subject reference. It's what you do. It's the issues you take on. It's the service. It's the service to the country. And I've had some uh, particular personal experience with that over the last 22 years in Israel uh, when being uh, requested to do things uh, and coming here and refusing to participate in Pollard-like scams with intellectual property uh, that I'm the author of. You would think, well, what's the problem? You can easily... Well, uh, a patriot understands strategic American interests and protects them. And I've been clobbered and had the foot on my neck for 22 years, so I know all about a patriotism, and I don't have any lapel in my, I haven't sung the national anthem, but I'm as much a patriot as any American, and in particular John McCain, and don't tell me about it, I know what it is to be under house arrest for 22 years, to be coerced by communists and socialists, to steal from America, uh, and I wouldn't do it. Okay, and I've had to pay the ex 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 tremendous price. Having said that, let's get to Tuckless. I'm Yoshua Yaakov, formerly Michael F. O'Donnell, an American citizen. I've lived for the past 22 years in Israel, and uh, I know the meaning of, uh, quote, the shining city upon the hill. Jerusalem is the shining city upon the hill, and what makes it shine? It shines when it's close to God, when it's in the service of the creator of the cosmos. And that's why I came here. When I saw the corruption that was in Washington and in the, uh, in the uh, Capitol Belt and the total corruption at the state and local level, I saw where America was going. I absolutely despaired. I came here to serve the God of the cosmos. And, uh, and, and the God of Israel is the God of the cosmos. And the result was he raised me up and he made me a Jewish leader. And the definition of a Jewish leader is the one who is the, uh, who is the leader of the, the Rove, the largest Jewish community in the world. I come from North America. That's the Rove. That's the community, the Jewish community that I'm the leader of. And secondly, the other condition to be the leader of uh, Klal Yisrael is to be closest to God. And for reasons beyond this video, that venue as well uh, is satisfied. And the prime minister and the princes, those are nominal leaders. Having said that, there is a great criticism of uh, Michelle Obama uh, in respect of her saying, for the first time in my adult life, I'm proud of this country. Let me tell you something, folks. I said that before Michelle did. And I'm saying it again. When I saw uh, Barack Obama's candidacy emerge, the, the only hope in the last 25 years, 30 years that I saw for American Americans is Barack Obama. His patriotism is unassailable, unquestioned, unquestionable. It's ridiculous. He knows what patriotism, he knows the difference between object reference symbols. Object reference patriotism is useless. American Americans need a subject reference president and leader. And who will lead from the front American Americans. And in what will he do? He will develop the East-West Convergence Model, which is humanomics. I'm the author 
of it. And it's two paradigms. The central organizing principle of Siva to give replace, replaces uh, the collapsed local reality of exile, which was giving to receive. That old model is finished. And the new economic paradigm, he will seek and receive a mandate from the U.S. Congress to build a world-class global technologic infrastructure to implement, develop, implement, and acculturate, which retrains, retools, and reeducates the entire U.S. work, making it the most competitive in the world for the century ahead and beyond. It'll take America from a 14 trillion to a 45 to 50 trillion. It will bring about a proper and just democratic re redistribution of uh, the GDP annually. Uh, when we go from 14 to 45 to 50, we're not going to have an 80-20 or a 70-30 split uh, between Wall Street and Main Street or a 60-40. The cost of building this technologic infrastructure to do this job will take four to five trillion dollars. Sixty percent of that in supply side investment for this massive project to retrain, re-educate, and retool the entire U.S. workforce based upon the new economic paradigm model will come from the G9. The other 40 percent will be amortized over 20 years. And this is a win-win situation. So this is the shining city upon the hill. This came from Jerusalem. This came from, from an American who is a patriot who served first and for, uh, listen first and listen only and serve the God of the cosmos while being in America, uh, being an American, serving America and Americans uh, because that's what he was given to do. And uh, this is the kind of patriotism we need today. Not talk, we need the real delivery of democracy. And Barack Obama is that man, and Michelle Obama, and I'm proud of both of them. And if you want to learn, if, any, if America and Americans want to learn what patriotism, go and listen and learn. Because those people, don't under, they understand what, patriot, what, democ what, de what delivering democracy is, what real patriot, the difference between object reference. Symbols mean nothing. They're for the they're for the they're for the false of heart, and uh, and they know the difference and they distinguish between object reference patriotism and subject reference patriotism. The latter is where you see Barack Obama and Michelle Obama coming from. This is what they're all about. And so uh, let us complete this uh, video. Um, uh, let us say uh, that. Uh, the experience that I've had over the past 22 years, um, I was tested as to whether I was an American patriot, whether I would remain loyal as an American, and I did. And through all coercions and at great personal sacrifice and cost to myself, to my family, to my company, to my shareholders, I remained a loyal American because the new economic paradigm is intellectual property. World-class science and technology is an intellectual property that is first and foremost a strategic asset of America. And only under the permissions of the Secretary of State and the President of the United States authorizing its development and the control of that strategic intellectual property asset in Israel can allow it to proceed and be developed here. It would not be handed over to the Israelis, and I refuse to. And I pay it an enormous, enormous, brutalizing price. I've been under attack. My family, my property stolen, my name, my honor in prison, and that's an American patriot. And I understand what patriotism And so when people start lecturing and talking about uh, Barack Obama's patriotism, I know a great deal about it. And I have the greatest respect for John McCain, but he's not the only American patriot. And um, my patriotism has been tested, and my medal has been tested to the very nth degree and limit. And Brook Hashem, I delivered the goods, and to this day I continue to deliver the goods. I haven't capitulated to the, uh, to the, to the weak-minded communist socialist uh, propagandists that founded this country and tried to coerce Jews to follow after their ignorance. Their claim of Zionism, and, uh, their, 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 their secular humanism uh, derives from communism and socialism. It's bankrupt, and the resulting Zionism has collapsed, and the emergent um, uh, humanomics model uh, which converges uh, secular humanism and uh, sp traditional spiritualism is the uh, construct in which the new uh, economic paradigm will enrich this country and America and this is the result of faith and patriotism and delivering the goods and America is going to deliver the goods as a democracy as well and I'm Yeshua Yaakov and I thank you for listening to this video this is what patriotism is all about my name is Yeshua Yaakov. I endorse this message, and I endorse Barack Obama, and I urge you to vote for Barack Obama and Michelle Obama. They're the best. Thank you. Shalom.